actually supposed to be out two weeks ago, but because I left my camera in Indiana, I'm just getting around to refilming this, you know, talking part now. So, I started school a few weeks ago, and the first day of school is always kind of stressful. It's even harder if you're really paranoid like I am about being in the wrong classroom. Because as far as I'm concerned, I am always in the wrong classroom on the first day of school, and I check my phone a bunch of times, and I just get really stressed out about it. Maybe I should check again. I'll just double check it one more time. I just, I need to be 100% sure that this is the right room. I just need to wait for class to start now. Uh, but these people don't look like they should be in here. I should check my phone again. Okay. Okay, it still says the same thing, but how do I know that I read the right thing? Do I go out there? But if I go out there again, will it look weird if I get up? And, uh, Hello students, welcome to that one class. Uh, we're going to be always in this room, it's 1404. Um, every time you come to this class, it's 1404. So welcome to that one class. Oh my gosh, what if this is the exact same class but I'm in the wrong one? My name will be on the list and it'll be embarrassing. I don't know anyone's seen this teacher before. Anyone could be teaching this class. I do, do I leave, do I stay? <laughs> that is 100% accurate. That's exactly what I do for every class until maybe like two or three weeks into school. And then my acting class first semester last school year had two different classrooms. So on Tuesdays we were on this floor in this room and then on Thursdays we were on a completely different floor in a completely different room. Then usually I'm the first person there so then I was even more confused because I don't, you can't expect me to learn two rooms and on two different days. I am so surprised I didn't go to the wrong room on the wrong day. Like, I just, how did I not do that? Probably because I was checking my phone every five minutes to make sure I was going to the right place. I don't remember always being like this. So I was trying to figure out what was the starting point to escalating to what it is right now. And I decided that it was my seventh grade Spanish class. was the first time I physically got out of my seat, went out of the room to check the door numbers again, which were right. What had happened was the school was all like, there's too many people taking Spanish, so you French teacher do you teach Spanish for us. Do you guys get really OCD about anything dumb like that? And I will see you guys later. Bye!